in any city, in any country, go to the nearest Buddhist temple. Upon your arrival, ask the first monk you see to take you to see a man named the Holder of Karma. A look of pure bliss will cross the monk's face, and he may sink into the ground. If he begins to fall, make sure to hold him up, and it will soon pass. The monk will take you into the temple and tell you to close your eyes. Do so, and he will ring a ceremonial gong once. When the gong goes silent, you may open your eyes. You will find yourself on a vast plain of grass. Walk through the grass until you come to a cliff which is perched over ragged rocks. There will be a soul man on this cliff, a monk of some years. He will have a wizened look to him, and skin that is tough as leather. If he wears a black robe, then quickly hurl yourself from the cliff, as it will be a more merciful death than any he will give you. If he has a white robe on, however, then approach him slowly. As you draw near, he will step from the cliff, but instead of plummeting to his doom, he will float suspended in mid-air. Without words, he will offer you a small vial and float several more feet away from the cliff ledge. Take the vial from him and drink it. Now is the moment of truth. Step from the ledge into the air. Should you be deemed unworthy, the weight of your sins and misdeeds will send you plummeting to your demise. If, on the other hand, you are not weighed down, you will be able to walk across the air. If you still live, the monk will smile and respond to only one question, which are good and which are evil. He will then tell you of every misdeed that was punished, of every good deed rewarded, of every vainglorious fool whose intentions sent them to the water depths below, of every pure seeker who failed and was corrupted. Many people will be unable to hear these truths, and will go mad, falling like so many others to their deaths. Be you strong of mind, however, you will preserve and endure. At the end of his tale, the monk will look to the sky behind him and comment about how a storm is approaching. Glide back to the cliff ledge and run through the fields of grass once more. Eventually the grass will thin and you will find yourself back outside the monastery where you started. The empty vial is object 333 of 538. For every misdeed you do to someone else, it will fill a little bit more with black liquid. Should it fill to the brim, your soul will be consumed by darkness. <laughs>